warming up for the World Cup in Canada. And the French women's football team has high hopes it can finally win its first major title. After a good season, Les Bleus are ranked third in the world. And having finished fourth four years ago in Germany and fourth again at the Olympics a year later, the players are extra motivated. We were frustrated at the World Cup and at the Olympics, but I think now we're better equipped because we've been through a lot. So I hope that this will benefit us and be a positive thing for this World Cup. A good World Cup would set the team up for 2019 when France hosts the tournament on home soil. It's a critical time for the French team, but with the game increasingly professional and trying to win over more fans, it's also an important tournament for women's football on the whole. We know that it's a key moment for women's football, a key moment because if we have a good World Cup in Canada and again in 2019, I think that can give women's football a considerable boost. In the past, the French team has been criticised for a lack of stamina in the big tournaments, but the players arrive in Canada in peak shape after a tough boot camp. I know I'm part of a good group with a lot of quality and that can go far in this World Cup. First, we have to concentrate on the group stage and after we will take each match one by one to go as far as possible. The team have a tough route to the final, kicking off their campaign against England on Tuesday and Mexico and Colombia also in their group. And the draw means they could have to overcome the world's top two ranked sides, Germany and the US, even to make it as far as the final.